a lot of people are trying to give me an a lot of people my wife included was saying is this a Tourette's thing I have Tourette's syndrome and I don't think it is right like uh, that feels like a cop out but I'm trying to understand why am I like this and like it's just kind of nuts how I keep doing these things and I keep uh putting my keep doing these horrible things right saying these horrible things I did not know this, but one of the symptoms of Tourette's, here, I'll show you this. I'm just, I was like, fuck, I don't know. I've been thinking about it. And people say, maybe it's your Tourette's. And I say, I've always been like, that's, that's a cop out. There's no way. I'm just a fucking, I'm just crazy. I don't know even how to explain it. But then, so I said, okay, you know, with Tourette's, I, I've always kind of like buried my head in the sand. I know I have it. But since I was a kid, the more I thought about it, the the worse it was. So my strategy of dealing with it was always kind of just to like forget that I have it or try not to think about it, try not to have it have a daily presence in my life <coughs> to try to feel like just normal as possible. And for the most part, I do find that that strategy worked. But I look up, you know, and one of the top results for symptoms of behavior is Compulsive behavior, impulsivity, you know what I mean? Lack of restraint. And these are some of the top things that are being uh, listed. So I think it's a bit of a cop-out. I don't think that, I think I have control over these things. I feel I do. But I don't know, maybe it has something to do with it. Uh, I don't know, because I'm not really even sure how to describe it. And obviously, that doesn't absolve me of any blame. Right? Like, I feel it's a cop out. But maybe, I don't know how to describe I don't even know how to explain it. But I am very sorry to um, Cutie. And uh, I do feel horrible and I, you know, support her 100% in trying to get that stuff removed, the deep fake stuff. And, you know, I offered that I, I have I obviously been through a lot of legal stuff and I have great litigators who work on just this type of thing. She mentioned that she wanted to sue them in her video. And I, I told her and I want her to know that, you know, if she needs resources, I would love to donate. Even if if she's open to that to fund this kind of thing. I strongly believe that this whole deep fake thing is like s super insane it might be legal because uh, there's no laws on the book. I don't know the legality of it. It hasn't really been tested in court that I'm aware. So I think it's a noble and good cause for her to do that. And uh, it could actually make a difference if if she would were able to get like some kind of law about doing doing deep fakes about of real people like that. So I just want to apologize to everybody and especially to Cutie who I respect. And actually think very highly of. And uh, I'm very sorry, guys. And I will I'll, we'll continue to try to do better and be more mindful uh, going forward.